Hey guys, Cody's here again and welcome to another episode of Survival Overdone. Thank you for joining me once again on my game video channel. And we are again here in Extinction where we still in our temporary base in the hole underneath the streets of the city. Don't know what the city is called, maybe one day we will find out in the Explorer Note of Two. I went ahead and built the stone wall course of a simple two reasons reason number one okay and reason number two disappeared it's also the same as reason one there's a reason two over there also make ethereum so <clears throat> because they are here i was afraid they will get into the raged mode and come attack me so i just have a stone outer shell basically just to make sure they don't come and get me but i've went and mined a bunch of resources so that we can get today and we got enough levels so that we leveled a few so we had level 29 so we can definitely get the stego saddle today so let's get to stego saddle and i saw one new type of saddle a velen a velonoso velonosaur velonos velonosaur or I guess that's it, but <coughs> excuse me. So, oh, I already learned the uh, Stego saddle, did I? Okay, well, great. So, we have um, the capabilities of a Stego saddle, and we also not storage stone. So, and we can also make stone gateways. I already went ahead and learned the, the engram. So, I just quickly want to scout. I know there's a level 70, 67 in this area with us. It's a level 6 Ankylosaur. When do we unlock that saddle? Let's quickly check. Ank 60, oh, 36. Where's the Stego? Was it the Anki we saw? Okay, well. And the Pterodon is only 38. Okay, so I'm glad the Megatherium's moved out, so that is good. Maybe we should put up gates here. That will also not be a bad decision to do. Okay, stay away from me. Let's see what level the Dirodon it is, in any case. There's a Stego. 33. Not bad. Not for the first one in any case. This is level 5. This one would be perfect, no? Oh, and something else. I believe with level 5 we will be able to make it. Don't get angry, Dave. Don't get angry. Thank you. Oh, also I have no idea with the enforcers. I actually was thinking about it. Uh, I think yesterday, if we, they attack dinos, doesn't matter if it's wild or not, or bears, they just attack dinos. So I'm not sure if they're going to attack our dinos or not, so really don't know what to do about it. And also while I was farming, I saw this little guy, so I tamed him because we're going to need oil and, and the um, fertilizer. Oh, I'm putting the same thing every time. Oh, so we don't have any more poop. Okay. Oh, what I want to show you guys. I'm getting sidetracked. Uh, weapons. Ranged. Looky here. Looky here. This is cheap. Let's make it. I've went ahead and I made a few arrows. Just a few. But we need narcotics and we do not have a lot of meat for narcotics. So we definitely need to get some sort of way to get more meat. Um, kill diners or anything. So now that we have this at least, let, let's use some of our arrows and see if we can go hunt some meat. I believe that is important for now. Okay, Anki we leave alone. We can maybe tame him. You see, there's, no, there's reason number two. He showed up. 
There's a dodo. And the reason number three. <gasps> oh, goodness. I don't like megatheriums. This is the first time I'm getting afraid of them. Okay, let's not go that way. As I said in a previous episode, they are hit hard. And I do not want to get hit by them again. And most shops usually has a lot of um, hide as well, so... And I'm near level 2, so... Let's get him. Okay, there's some meat. Oh, poor Lustro. 187. Yeah, well, it's useless. We can't use that, so... We need the males to be able to farm thatch. Thatch. Oh, well, we need to get the bike. Didn't I learn it now? I think we learned it now. Okay, what level are you at? Level 174. The Stego. 67. Oh, that's the one that was inside. Maybe we should try and trap that one. I believe it would be easy to trap it. Um, just a few gateways. Um, dinosaur gateways and that's it. But again, I'm not sure what the enforcer will do. Maybe we should take a low level dino, let's say dodo, let it follow us and see what the enforcer does. In place of just losing a a nice stego. Yes, let's let's do that. I wanna spoil this. Where is the spoiling button? Oh uh, no. Okay, uh, we will need I'm not gonna waste waste a durability of the primitive Ah not the primitive the crossbow for a dodo bike yes we did learn it Let's see. weapons melee melee uh, cheap cheap okay so we'll use this one for throw if we need it but this one will definitely be much better okay dodo let's go look for a dodo Oh, and we need berries. So let's just farm berries. We'll get some narco berries as well. We need. That's another reason why you need the stego. We need to get berries. And the stego is a good berry farmer. Not as good as a a um, bronto, but still pretty good. Okay, so we are and another megatherium. This place is littered with megatheriums. That's not good. There was raptors there if you couldn't see that guys. They were quite in a distance. Looks like tech rexes. Ugh, not rexes, um raptors. Come on enforcer, take it on. There's an enforcer right there. Um Still need a dodo. So mayo berries is basically your base bed. Oh, and poop. Oh, that was mine. <laughs> Let's grab these out. This will help us if something attacks us. Maybe a dialo. Oh, and there's enforcer right there. So let's do we have meat? No, we do not have meat. There's a dialer up there as well. So let's kill the dialo for its meat and go tame the other dialer with uh, this dialer meat. Yeah, not cannibalism, right? <laughs> and there's a stego as well. I saw a terror bird here, right? Why 
teleport there, you teach. Oh well. Number six, come on. Added the stone arrow. Okay, so at least we got a stone arrow back for that one. Since we can't see through bushes, let's farm the bushes. This, let's call him Crash this dummy. <laughs> Okay, yes, follow me please. I know the enforcer attacks everything on sight. Sorry, I'm not gonna kill you though. I'll protect you though. So you are gonna be my test subject to see what the enforcer does. Dialos, dialos were my friends in the beginning. Back in a day. Now I just skipped him totally. Okay, it seems like he's leaving him alone. Oh, 187. Another poopy. Oh, great. It's leaving me alone. Okay, good to know. Okay, so let's take a dialer back. And now we can tame a Stego. Let's see what level this is. 107. Uh, I don't want to bite off more than we can chew again. So maybe we should just go for that level 67. I think that would be the safest... And there's the reasons again. So let's bypass the reasons. I want to jump down. Oh, we can't. That's the floor. Okay, maybe we can go down. And crash test. No, let's wait for him. Yep, it's too fast for us to run around and let him fall down because I know they don't um, they they don't get fall damage. Okay, so let's make a few narcotics and a few knockout darts more or trank darts and a few. What you, what you call it, um, stone gateways, we'll just put them in a hallway type of configuration, put a pillar type of thing in, um, on an end, and that would, should be it, let's quickly see, this, 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 Seeds. Berries can now go into our cooler. And we have meat in here, so take out the meat, put the poopy in and put the meat in. And we have that meat. Um, spoiled meat. Great. And quickly make a few of these. 50. Great. Well, that should be quite sufficient. Well, that's crafting. Let's quickly get a few gateways. Do we only have enough? Four. I wanted to make five. Let's see what we need. I believe it will be thatch. Let's quickly go and mine some thatch. Okay. Two trees inside respawned. So each hundred is an extra gateway. Okay, 
I had a bunch of thatch, I just think I wasted it, all of them on on the stone structures. So I, I can't remember what's new guys, um, I don't think anything is new, I just moved the um, mortar pestle up there, stone another one, let's get stone pillars, a dope, no thank you, is small, medium and large, let's get one large, stone gateway, right? Yes, and three I yes. I believe this is all we need. Let's go check. I don't like this spot. Definitely I have to move either by the end of this episode or the next episode. We just need to get ourselves a proper Oh, we need the arrows. Oh, it's five narcotics. Oh, narco berries. Okay, so let's make a few more arrows. Um, let's say ding. Should be enough. No, <laughs> let's not say should. Let's go with 20. So that's 40 arrows for level 64. And it's on the crossbow. So hopefully. And we have a few narcotics left to keep him under if we need it. And we need a few mayo berries to retain itself. Okay. So what we're going to do, I'm going to put down our bow, I don't want to shoot a arrow by mistake. No, wrong button, I keep pressing wrong button. I think it will fit through here, I do think so. Let's rather... Make it a bit closer. Okay, yes, I don't believe... Oh, maybe this one. That should be good. Medium pillar over here. Oh. This, oh, this is that 187 that was up there. Gee whiz, the dinosaurs roam a lot. So we need to put this on five or two seconds. What's it? Um, Set so close delay. I believe five seconds is good. It might be too long. Okay, he's going to struggle to turn around. So maybe not. Okay. Where's our target? Oh goodness. That's what I mean. These guys roam a lot. Oh 
Oh, no, I don't have time for you guys. I want I want to have a whole army of compies. Was that one over there? I think that's a mega theorem that killed me that one time. Yes, it's this one. Okay, I want to stand up here. There we go. Straight shot, straight shot, thank you. Doesn't, don't they fit? I hope he's in. Where is this one spot? Looks like in the neck is a high spot that you get. Oh no! He's outside. At least we can use this to get away. Where's he going? Okay, he's coming back for another round. Oh, easy. Come on, pass out, pass out. There we go. Great. Just want to make sure the Mega Theorems isn't coming to us. Okay, I'm just going to give him off for now. Okay, good. We have him. A 67 isn't bad. Okay. Okay, I believe that will be enough. Okay, great. Well, we... He's passed out. Looks like he'll be safe. Let's pick up this. Ooh, there's a potato. Please land inside here, so that I can catch you. Unfortunately, it's a bit high. I know, even though I know the Enforcer is friendly, I'm still scared of it. Okay, at least we have 100% effectiveness. That's great. Okay, let's make a saddle for it so long. If that enforcer is going to attack us, I'm going to lose it. Okay, saddles. What is a saddle made in a... Inside here? Yes. <laughs> Apparently it is. Okay, so now it's a waiting game. Just making sure it's safe. You see, and this is a point part that I mean this you, it's this is not skill. This is the round and sitting and waiting for it to tame out. 
So for that purist out there that wants people to play on pure vanilla settings, I even don't understand why vanilla servers would take days for one time. It doesn't really take skill. It just opens more possibilities to be grieved, even on PvP servers. Oh, and speaking of PvP servers, um, we are gonna wipe a server earlier than expected. We're gonna wipe on... Let me just get the date quickly for you guys. Okay, we're gonna wipe on the 16th of November. And we are gonna go to PvPVE mode. So Saturdays there will be a time slot for PvP. And there are rules in place for that. So yes, anyone want to join are welcome to join. And yes, there's a, a website that's linked to the to the server. Everything will be found in the description. So feel free to check that out. Um, there's rules for PvE and PvP specific players. Um, the PvE doesn't have a lot of rules because well, <laughs> there's not a lot they do wrong. Um, i.e. they don't destroy bases because pve times are they can't destroy bases and so on basically the rules for them is just don't not to build in resource rich places and also that goes why didn't they ask for a name well and that also goes for the pvp guys obviously and yeah we have a stego but there's a bit more rules for PvPs since we... Oh, that looks cool. That looks much better than by hand. Come on, you can do it. Okay. But yeah, our PvP has rules to protect and to have a good gaming experience. So feel free to come and check that one out, guys. Okay, let's get this back to base. Okay, we definitely need to get stamina. Oh wow, it's so little in speed. It's so little! Oh goodness. Why is it so slow? I forgot this is slow. This is walking speed, this is running speed. Oh goodness gracious. Now I know why I don't tame these. Goodness gracious. No, this way. And now you miss it. This thing is too slow to <laughs> make a U turn for that. And there's another Sega up there. Okay, so we can at least farm berries quicker now. So that is awesome. Let's grab a few berries. We put this ones back into. Okay. Great. Let him be. We got berries. Okay, first let's put away the seeds. Okay, so we have a tame, guys. So we made up for the taming fail from the last episode. We seem like to have been a lot of fails these days. <laughs> We had that massive fail on aberration with the um, with the roll rat. Oh, that was fun. Oh, the funds we had. These, 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 these. And look at all the stem berries. Great. Now let's see if we can get some sort of um, flyer going. We have enough of that, we need meat. Okay, if we can get a flyer, we are good. We are good, we are set. There's one. Oh, come on, really? Look how spiteful he is. He's going to land right there. He could have landed just a bit, few meters this way. Um, how difficult is it going to be to get up there? That side is mega theorem, so I don't want to go that side. So we'll have to run around. But I'm sure by the time we get there, he's going to be away. And guess what? We can't get onto this Stego to run up there. 
that is way too slow. So as I explained to you guys in a previous episode, I want to be higher up. I do not like to be this low. Okay, great. Level 53, not bad. Let's use number 6. 1, 2, 3. There we go. Okay, why did I want to freak out there is because arrows takes a bit longer to take effect than um, um, what you call it than bullets or trank doors or something like that does. Okay, you shouldn't take long. Uh, level 33 only. Okay, I know we don't have a saddle for it, but at least we have a flyer. Once you have a flyer in this game, you're basically set for life. <laughs> Except if it dies, obviously. Let's see, what level can we... And our level is good. Correct again. So, yes, this um, definitely seems it's when a server restarts, it resets. Once, okay, no, I was very unclear on that explanation. Once you die and you respawn, or you upload and download, the... Um, the amounts goes funky, so you have to restart the server before it's fixed. So every time we die, we will have higher stats. For some reason, I'm not sure why. So if you see my higher stats, or if you see me dying, then by that point we will have higher stats. And honestly, I have no idea why it does that. Is that a Hinadon? I've never tamed a Hinadon. I think you need to crouch down and pet it or something like that. I don't know, it was just too much speed. Yeah, I never researched it or looked into it. Look at all these skills we need to tame, guys. Woohoo! But now we can fly up to our base. We can go explore up by. Can even go explore above those buildings. We can maybe go see what is it what it is that makes a rocket sounds. That's always fun. Okay, you see across the ways, the enforcer doesn't take on stegos because it's too big, but the defense unit does. So I hope our dino is safe here. If it isn't Please let me know, guys. Um, then we definitely need to get upstairs as quickly as possible and gate off the place. Okay, he's coming with me. Okay, unfortunately, I'm not going to jump down again. It's too much health. Oh, and we need to eat. Let's poop because we need this. And then we eat. Let's see if it can land inside here. <laughs> that would be awesome. Oh, it just goes... Okay, 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 okay. Stand still, stand still. There we go. And then you go land there for me, please. There we go. Now it should be safe. That's a nice red one. Okay, we don't have a saddle yet, so let's quickly see what level is the saddle again for that. I am potato on. 30, oh, 38. I hoped it was like 28 because we're not too far from that. Oh, we're not far from 38. Okay, good. And what else? Let's see what we can quickly learn. Okay, wood ladder is also... I always like building with wood ladders to get to other floors and wood railings. That always looks good. We can maybe make some armor for us. That's, that could be something good. Wooden raft, I'm not sure if we're going to use that because I haven't seen a huge water body on this map yet. Um, not with that um, small exploration part we did. Skip that. 
fur. We'll definitely use fur at the later stage. Marvelous spyglass I also learned. I haven't made made it yet. We need cementing paste. Let, we can make that actually. We'll do that just now. This is this is the first time using it. I have no idea how it works. So we'll check that out together. We'll use metal spikes. Sword no. I don't know why they have a sword before a, or after a pike. Because a pike does much more damage than a sword. Sickle for the for um, uh, fiber. Mammoth. Definitely need a mammoth for wood. Snow biome probably have a mammoth. Actually, we'll need later. Megaloceros. I believe that's it. Uh, what I want to do. Oh, bye. sure what I wanted to do. Oh yes, um, I wanted to get the um, cementing paste. So let's make pool for 10. Do we have enough for 10? We do. Great stuff. So let's do this one quickly. It's a spyglass. That one pool craft. Let's see how this one operates. Okay, where's a wild dino? Okay, it's basically the same as Super Spyglass. But it's not in the way, in the middle, in the way. It's out of the way. I know it's zoomable. Oh! Oh, there's no... thing on, um, around you when you go okay so what other options do we have show wall that's fine variable zoom increased range okay okay cool so we can definitely use this let's put it on 8 so we can always decrypt it in. Again, you don't have to keep it up to your 8 volt time, you can just have it close by. Okay, that's good. That's good, that's good. And we need some metal. I want to get a feeding trough so that we f can feed our dinos at least. Stay away from me. Oh, I see we've been running a, a few minutes over time. I've heard some of the uh, um, subscribers say they don't mind it if we go over time. So hopefully everybody has that same feeling. So hopefully it's fine <laughs> that we go a few minutes over, but I won't go over every time. Sometimes I will try to keep as close to half an hour as possible, but I believe now we're already eight minutes over. So let's quickly get a feeding trough and then we call it a day. And we need your eating. Oh, we did pick up poop, right? Let's give it to him. That's a very slow sort of oil, but it's a steady sort of oil, especially over about two. But you make so many. Um, what do you call it? Fertilizer that you don't know what to do with. Give me your meat. Give me your meat. Give me your poop. <laughs> Sounds weird in so many ways. You also have poop. Give me your poop. Now take the poop. <laughs> yeah, that's just weird. And the trough is over here. Great. Okay, so now everybody can get food and everybody's happy, right? Great. So I think we accomplished a lot in this episode, guys. I'm going to try and level up a bit more. Uh, well, by a farming, that is for now. We need thatch. We ran out of thatch this episode. And we'll need a bit more stone. I'll see if we can get more metal. But thatch is definitely a priority. For now, it's just a few trees. But and once I level and we get the saddle for this guy, I will... 
have another episode up and running for you guys. So I'll do a little preparation now and then I'll bring you guys back tomorrow for the next episode and then we can kill Aina. It's quite our level. Oh no, 33. How did I look? They, they, I have to tell you guys a quick joke. This, these two hyenas were sitting under a tree. One looks to the other and tunes him. What are you laughing about? We haven't eaten for days. Uh -huh. <laughs> Stupid one. Any case. <laughs> uh, any case, guys. Thank you guys for coming to join me. I'm going to call it there. It's late in the evening. Or night or whatever. And I'm telling stupid jokes, so no, definitely time to call it for this episode, guys. Uh, once again, thanks for joining me, guys. Check the description for all the links to websites, to the Discord channel, public Discord. You're all welcome to come have a chat with me. Links to my website, links to the public ARC server, and also there's a separate website. It's just a page for the server itself, the server company that I'm hosting the, the ARC server with um, as a ability to or not the ability they give you a free website with it and i it gives you the mods the players online etc and all the other information is on there so please feel free to check that out before you want to join the server if you want to have information regarding the server the rates etc is on there and also there's a special link in the description which gives you a 24 hour trial if you want to host your own server so check that one out and yes then yeah please remember to subscribe leave a like or a dislike and please remember to comment guys that helps me a lot and especially help me with the content that i'm trying to create and please support my hobby by subscribing and then i will see you in the next one cheers